Connected. The strangest, strangest bike. Uh, like, what is this? And it's a Harley. It's all I just took the bike out quietly, not to wake up the neighbors. Literally, all you can hear is uh, the cricket over there. You're gonna roll the bike down down there then start it up just by the house of the neighbor that i don't like too much uh, and uh, gonna go meet john from there we're gonna ride to meet everybody else at wawa and there and then uh hit the road direct uh, to um palisades new york 9w to another meet uh, bikes and breakfast uh, it's gonna be nice weather out, so we're gonna have a ride after that. Meet, meet people, have something to eat because I just two, took two sips of my coffee. Meet people, shake hands, say hello, and group up for a quick ride around the area, and then head back home. So let's hit the road. Using a helmet that I've been neglecting for a while. One, two. How's that centered? No, not really. Roll it. Roll it. There you go. Rolling, rolling, rolling. That's it. This neighbor I like. That neighbor I like. Right here, this guy I don't like. Okay, here we go. to Wawa and I've it's funny I meet a lot of subscribers for the first time uh, I hear the voices I see their their comments and I just get to see them now in real life it's funny you envision somebody in a certain way and he's completely different when you see him and look we didn't come here first there the other guys came here first and what a mess I'm telling you look, look how they park all their bikes look how they park their bikes unbelievable what a mess there are bikes over here that I'm seeing for the very first time. This is a, a limited edition. I'm seeing the Pan America for the first time. Oh, and the 1290. Glenn's 1290. It's every bit of it. You install the T-bar on your on your bike? No, it comes like that. No. <laughs> Today I'm uh, I'm wearing my other helmet, so I don't have the setup. I apologize, I don't have the uh, the camera on my helmet, so the view is going to be all from the 360, and the sound is going to be coming from the microphone right here. Hopefully, uh, it's going to be decent. John's Ducati, noisy as fuck. It's a big group today. I think like 16 bikes. Nice. Let's see. 
Let me try. Let me do a little count over here. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen bikes. If I got it right. A variety of bikes for Harleys and Ducatis, one Aprilia. Bunch of old timers. Midlife crisis. <laughs>
That's Glenn's new KTM, 1290 Adventure, beautiful bike over there. Jerry's Pan America. Nice Pan America over there, two ADVs. I'm actually considering uh, to do a little change, not change, but an addition with an ADV. Uh, hopefully, it's kind of going to break some uh, good news, big news next uh, next few videos regarding an ADV. my bike yesterday I got this whole area wet and the uh, volume controls are not working let's see if the horn is working the lights are working the horn is working the radio control is not working it's still wet
bikes around here heading towards Bikes and Breakfast. Meet them. Let's ride along Hector over here. Listening to his blasting music. I love his, his uh, boombox. I get the aggressive face mask. No chance. What? <laughs> Straight through uh, the middle of the, the road. 
and if you hit something like that at 50, and we're almost there. Just a dude, a 50 year old dude on my bike. What the heck is that? Okay. Jerry got us organized to put our bikes in one, blocking the other. So at least we're blocking each other. And when we want to get out in an hour or two, we don't have to. Well, a little cool, cool little uh, idea that I have over here. Some of you probably heard of it, uh, but my bike is going to be staying here for an hour or two, uh, and I need my phone charged. So just my trickle charger. Uh, cable over here with this little adapter okay connect it like so one hand it again like that connect it connect your uh, your cable charging cable and connect it to your phone and you're good obviously link down by the description yeah how to pick it up I think it's like 10 15 dollars worth it absolutely they're gonna do something a little bit different today. Uh, I'm not gonna waste all my film on my phone. I'm gonna do snapshot, like every two, three seconds, a bike. That's how I'm gonna do it. So enjoy, put it with some music, enjoy this.
that the government didn't buy it, so they produced it for two years, hoping that they would, and then they never bought it. Uh, they went with the Kawasaki, the Kawasaki KX. Yeah. 250. This is a 500. The strangest, a 500 strangest bike. Yeah, yeah. Uh, like, what is this? And it's, it's a like Harley. A it's all engine. It's all plastic, like a yeah, yeah. poly, some kind of polymer. That's for a gun or yep. whatever. Yep. Oh, that's for On. Are they rare? Are these bikes rare? Yeah, they only made 500 of them. Wow! That have the Harley and are made in York, Pennsylvania. So, wow. So it's pretty much a collector's yeah. item at this stage, I right? I guess I bought it, you know, get out. I don't ride it every day, but. Have any clue what it's uh, valued? Uh, I've seen it go anywhere from the highest, like with. Zero miles on them, twenty-four thousand. Okay, so okay. One at an but hold on to it because yeah. it definitely is. Uh, it's this a collector's. Five hundred miles on it. I like to ride it. Oh, it's nice. I don't like to leave it. Pretty there. cool, and it's light, right? It's what? Light, oh, lightweight. Yeah, 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 absolutely. One cylinder, five hundred. You say? Yep, five hundred cc. They made them in a three fifty, and then they made them. Uh, Rotax? Why yep. Rotax? Rotax engine? Austria, I think. No, no, Rotax, they use it for uh, aviation. Yeah. They use it in uh, uh, it a little glider. It was a proven motor that they wanted to go with. Kind of bulletproof. So kind of a joint venture between Harley, Rotax, whatever. Yep. Uh, Pretty cool. Other, anything with Harley Davidson on it, they only made 500. Wow. Yeah. It's very cool. And even though it's been... Okay, I got enough footage. Ran out of uh, film. Got to go charge uh, the phone and grab something to eat. We're gonna hit the road from here, go to uh, uh, Greenwood Lake. See, that's the problem with these phones. They, they check them too much. Everybody, we were planned on going for a ride up to Greenwood Lake, but then they started checking the weather radar and everybody is fleeing the scene like chicken. So we're gonna go back home. Hope you enjoyed this ride. I'm gonna put a few uh, shots riding home. Uh, so, yeah, they're just running. Look at that.